only advice they gave us was to go left at the split. We've yet to see a split. Turn me, turn me, turn me, turn me! Not that way! Stay in the boat! I don't know where we are. We don't know when to pull out. Why is this so confusing? <laughs> we're Zach and Allie, and this is Nomadic Habits. Today we're taking an 11 mile whitewater rafting trip down the Rogue River with the dogs. We have absolutely no idea what kind of rapids we're going to experience on the river. All I know is we have about two hours before we need to be there. So we're gonna feed the dogs, eat some breakfast, pack a bag, maybe a lunch, and pray for the best. Luckily, we were able to leave the van and walk over here. Um, these guys are gonna shuttle us to the drop-off point and then we're gonna pull out right where the van is actually at. So it kind of works out perfect for us. But if you recall in last week's video, we took the dogs paddle boarding and it was something that I had done before, but Zach had never done. But I've never whitewater rafts and Zach has. When I was a kid, um, I actually worked at a summer camp and we would do um, the Nantahala River once a week. So I have plenty of experience going down the Nantahala on rafts as well as kayaks and little inflatable ducking and stuff. Okay. No more. You wanna wait here and I'll do it? Yep. All right. Come. Hi. How are you? Good, how are you? Are you girls ready? Are you ready? She said, hang out right here and he'll pick us up. Okay. I'm up there, you old Marley. Thank you. Fingers in. So, we're kind of lucky his job takes us all over the place. Are you excited? I'm kind of nervous. The water's going to be cold. And I've got to use the restroom, but there isn't a bathroom here. It's like I'm going to be holding it for a while. For the next 11 miles. We're going to be taking this little raft <laughs> down the river. Looks like we're coming up onto some kind of fun stuff up here. I can hear the water getting louder. So when we started out, we asked the, um, the owner, the guy that gave us the ride out here, if he had any advice. And the only piece of advice he gave us was, when the river split, stay to the left. Hold out, turn me, quickly. Turn, turn, turn. Woo, thank you, shit. Macy, sit now. <laughs> Macy, for the love of Pete, sit down. Hold out. We're touching bottom. What do you think, Marley? Okay, Macy, you too. Where does this bridge even go to or come from? This is cool. Super cool. So in one of our previous videos, we talked about how we beat the heat while living in a van. And this is a really good way to beat the heat. It's supposed to be almost 90 degrees today. And we thought, why not come out and try rafting the road? I overheard a local talking saying that you can't say you live in Oregon without rafting the road. So I'm guessing it's a pretty big thing around here. Turn me, turn me, turn me, turn me! Not that way! I don't want to go backwards! Why are you going backwards? Zachary! See you later, guys.
guys. <laughs> Look what I got. Go get it. Go get it, Mar. Go on, Marley. Go get it. Go. Good girls. White on the front, red on the back. Let me throw it again, Macy. Come here. Here. Oh, it's so cold. Marley, you ready to go? Load up, Mar. Come on, load up. Macy, load up. Load up. Ready when you are. No, Macy. Macy. Macy, bad. Come, here. Come on. Come on now. Come on. Macy, come now. Macy, come, Macy, come, come. now. Get over here. Macy, come on now. Come on. Come on. Stay in the boat. Hey, you stay in the boat. No, Macy, sit. Sit. Ah! sit. I think this is a great river for beginners, um, kids, people with dogs. It's definitely relaxing. There's a couple fun rapids, but it's nothing super crazy or anything like that. So definitely a, a fun beginner river. It's so peaceful out here. My babies are getting tired, I think. has acquired this new skill that I can't decide if it's a good thing or a bad thing but like she likes to stand on the edge of the boat and just both all four paws on the edge of the boat when we're going down rapids and I'm like what are you doing Macy Macy get back on this boat now Macy get on here now Macy come on on now Macy now get in here now now, come on, Macy. Now, <laughs> oh my gosh, <laughs> stay in the boat. No, don't get in. I'm gonna go back to the beginning when we said the only advice they gave us was to go left at the split. We've yet to see a split. There was like no proximity of like how far we needed to go before we were gonna hit the split. Just go left and What do you think of that? Macy's like, this is awesome. Can we do this every day? <laughs> we passed it a long time ago. We did, we passed it earlier. We passed it a long time ago. I don't know where we are. We don't know when to pull out. Why is this so confusing? <laughs> the river's gonna turn at some point and it's gonna go this way. 
Zachary, what are you doing? Oh my gosh, your right side is blistered. It's bad. Thank you, Rapid Pleasure, for allowing us and our animals to wrap the rogue. We had an absolute ball. If you're staying in Shady Cove at any one of the campgrounds that's easy to get to, Rapid Pleasure will actually let you pull out at one of those locations and they'll come pick up the rafts there, which is super convenient. Go on. <laughs> Go on, Mark. <laughs> Oh, I want to go again.